Welcome! In front of me I have Huawei Watch D and I'm gonna show you how to pair this watch with an iPhone. First thing you will need to do is to turn on the watch. And to turn it on simply press and hold the home button right here and keep holding it until you see the Huawei logo on the screen. Once you see the logo you can uh, release the button and wait until the watch turns on. After the watch turns on, you should see the list of languages on the screen. You can scroll through this list by swiping up and down on the screen. Now, find the language you like to use and tap on it to select it. I'm going to select English UK. And once you select the language, you will see this message. Basically, we need to download and install Huawei Health application on our iPhone. So, make sure you have the internet connection and Bluetooth enabled on your iPhone. And once you do, open the App Store. In the App Store, tap on the search icon, then tap on the search bar and type in Huawei Health. And tap on search. Right here on the list, you should see this application, Huawei Health. Tap on it. And then tap on the Get button to download and install it. Okay. And once the application is done installing, you can tap on the Open button to open it or you can open it by tapping on the icon uh, of the app. Okay, I'm just gonna tap right here on open button. Then I'm gonna, uh, or rather, now we can allow or deny permission for the notifications. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on the watch, you need to allow this permission. If you don't care, you can deny it. I'm just gonna allow it. Then in the app, I'm gonna tap on next. And here, I'm gonna tap on allow. Again, we can allow the permission for the Bluetooth. This one is required, so please tap on OK. And here, tap on Let's Go. And it will open the Health Access page. And basically here we can allow features like heart rate, resting heart rate and stuff like that. Basically, Huawei Health app to write the data from for them and read the data for them. So you can customize this list by tapping on the switches. So for example, if you want to or you want the app to be able to write the data uh, to the heart rate, you can select this or this, basically tap to enable it. And if you want to uh, the app to be able to read the data, you can also enable it right here. I'm just gonna tap on turn on all and then allow, but you can customize it to your liking basically. And once you're done with the health permissions, you should see the health page in the app. Now, tap on Devices, tap on Add. The app will start scanning for the nearby devices and after a couple seconds it, it should detect your uh, Huawei Watch D. Here we have it, you can tap on the link. Confirm the pairing on the watch by tapping on the check mark. and then tapping on pair on our iPhone. Right here we can allow the permission for the location. This is useful if you want to track the, for example, routes when you're running and stuff like that. So if you want to use that, allow the permission. If you don't care, you can deny it. Now we have a pop-up about the contacts permission. If you want to receive the notifications about calls and who's calling you on your watch, you need to allow this permission. If you don't care, you can deny it. And right here we can check the box to enable auto download uh, update uh, via the Wi-Fi. And you can check it if you want to, and then you can tap on done. Right here we have a tutorial how to use the uh, blood pressure measurement device on our watch. I'm just gonna tap on cancel to skip it. And as you can see, we have the device page for our Huawei Watch D. And when we wake up the screen on it, it's ready to use and we can use our watch now. Okay, and that's how you pair this watch with an iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.